right, guys, I'm going to be using this stuff right here, the Santa Snow Naive, and it's only $4.99 at Hobby Lobby, half off right now. It's only $2.50, so that's not a bad deal, but it says to shake it pretty well and then give it a good spritz. So we're going to go ahead and do that. So this is not a flocking spray, but you can totally buy one. Um, I looked for one, but I just couldn't find them anywhere for some reason. Don't know why. I think they're trying to hold us back on that. I'm sure, it will come out later in the season. But for now, I'm going to try this product out. And basically, you just shake it up and just give it a little spritz on it like this. And this stuff doesn't, like, dry. So you can totally just, like, wipe it away. So if you don't like the look... But I'm going to go like at an angle downwards on the tree. So I recommend this product for smaller trees like this. If you're doing this on a large scale tree, I don't recommend this product. Again, this wipes right off. So you're putting a lot of ornaments and stuff on it. It's going to come right off. If you want more of a permanent white snowy effect, I recommend going through with your cheap white spray paint from Walmart. Giving this like a full on coat. Just... Just go ahead and go to town with the spray paint, then go back through with this snow effect. So as you can see, the tree is not fully like white how I was wanting it. However, with flash, obviously you can see a lot more of the snow. Um, during natural daylight, you can't really see. You can see like pieces where I missed, but I was totally fine with that. I added a few ornaments to this and I thought it looked pretty good. So I just kind of left it. Anyways, so guys, today's the day I wanted to show you this cute little Christmas wreath. I wanted to spruce it up just a tad bit. So I'm going to actually remove it from the door and show you what I'm going to do. I'm a messy crafter. We all know this. All right. So I wanted to start by taking off these little red ribbon things. I just don't want them on the wreath anymore. So I have to figure out how they're attached. Okay, I think I got all the ribbons off. The next thing I'm going to take off is these little berries here. Then I think I'm going to leave the pine cones on. And I'm going to leave the little red berries because I don't really care for them to be white. So now I'm going to take this outside and I'm going to give it a pretty good coat of spray paint. I'm just using the cheap Walmart spray paint, the white. I'm going to make sure like all of these are kind of fluffed up how I want it before I take it out there. So again, this is what I'm using, uh, Color Place. It's the cheap spray paint from Walmart. All right, I got the whole thing sprayed with white. I'm going to go ahead and let this dry. Once it's dry, I'm going to be using that Snow Naive again. And I'm just going to be doing this at an, again from the top to the bottom. So it looks like the snow is sitting on like how it's going to be hanging, if that makes sense. <laughs> so I only did it like in one direction with the snow. And it's ready to hang back up. I think this looks so much better. It's like this really nice flocked out wreath. It looks so good. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. So all I'm gonna do for these pieces is paint them white. I painted this cone-shaped bucket with stars on it, all white, and then I just took that same brush and lightly went over these Christmas trees just so it looks like snow just fell on them. I think that gave this a nice touch. So you kind of get the gist of what the trees look like. So I'm not going to show you like an after because this is pretty much it. And then we'll go ahead and show you what the little cone-shaped bucket thing turned out like. And here it is. I'm not too fond of it, but you can just display it however you want, I guess. 
And then for these pieces, these ornaments, I went in and I just painted, well, I took them apart first. As you can see, there's this little tree inside of here. I took that out and I painted the outside part all white on all three of these. I took these bows and the little, uh, little uh, beads, I guess, that were glued onto the trees and just threw those away because I wasn't going to use those again. And then the little tree that's inside, I just took that outside and spray painted those white. And they didn't fully saturate with white, but I mean, they sort of turned out, I guess. <laughs> All right, and that is the end of the Christmas thrift flip. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.